All right, it's time for another DSD Plus Fast Lane video. So, earlier we did a P25 system when we learned how to edit our site and groups files. But let's say you've uh, you've acquired a list of frequencies, maybe like an SDR sharp in your frequency manner. You've been saving frequencies that are active in your area and you'd like to scan through them with your DSD plus fast lane well you can so you see like you go in your area I'm gonna look through here real quick go over to your county and you got all these FMN frequencies, you know, just regular old analog frequencies. And you've been saving these, you know, maybe you wrote a list of them down. I got a list of uh, the frequencies that are, that get used in my area, they're active, you know, but nobody's talking on them all the time on one frequency, so I'd like to scan through these. Well, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your your fast lane folder and we'll be using FMP 24 and you can scroll down here you're gonna see FMP 24 scan list and we're gonna open that up with text editor so in here it's gonna tell you how to go about doing it you hit S for the scan mode escape exit to get out of it it's gonna tell you how you can format it and you would put your list of frequencies above this mark right here. And uh, we'll go over later how to do it, you know, the clean way. Put your frequency, the modulation, the bandwidth, delay time that you want to stay on it and all that. But right now we're going to do a quick and dirty one. So I don't want to edit this folder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rename it. I'm going to copy this name and then I'm going to rename this file and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do this and put BAK for backup and I'm going to save it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a new file and I'm going to save it as and I'm going to give it that original name, the FMP24 scan list. I'm going to hit all types and hit save okay now I'm gonna go over and copy the list of frequencies that I want to scan through and I'm gonna put them in that new scan list file that we made I'll paste them in there and I'm gonna save that now we're gonna go over here and we're gonna fire up FMP 24 EXE so I'm going to open that up. And hit the space bar to mute it for a second. Now, you can run it this way or you can run it from an EXE or from a batch file in CMD. And you can choose your output devices if you want to use it different than what it's choosing. Because right now it's using our main speakers. And it's telling you, I've got our freak list. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to hit the question mark while we're in here. And it's going to give us those keys. So, S starts to scan. And then, let's see... You hit exit to escape, escape to exit, and then there's a cue for squelch mode. So, if I hit the space bar in a minute and hit key, squelch mode, we're now squelched. So, unless somebody's talking on a frequency, it's going to stay squelched. Now, we're going to adjust our gain down.
take our cane down a little bit. We're going to adjust our bandwidth. There we go. All right. And now we're going to hit S. It is now scanning through our list. And we just sit here and you chill back, do other stuff, and wait for people to talk so you can listen in. You see, I'm going to click through here when they start giving personal information on here so I don't get in trouble for that, but we'll let it run a few more. When you see it, you're scanning through. Like you said, when you set it up the proper way, you can set for delays and stuff so you can make it with somebody... Sounds like there's a wreck. But you set it up proper, you can set it to where it stays on there. Even if they quit talking, it'll stay for like 2.5 seconds or 5 seconds, whatever you choose, to wait for the reply. But that's it. That's a that's a dirty scan. We'll uh, come back at a later date here and uh, we'll set it up proper.